McMaster University has received federal funding to investigate an alarming spike in pandemic-relating eating disorders in children. Pediatric expert Jennifer Couturier will receive a few hundred thousand dollars for the project as part of a $13 million federal funding investment into pandemic research. Couturier is the director of the eating disorders program at McMaster that helps more than 200 kids. She says throughout the pandemic, the country has seen eating disorder referrals double and hospitalizations triple. Our theories include that the lockdowns and restrictions <clears throat> have impacted young people, creating anxiety and mood issues that then translate into eating problems, body image concern, and a search for how to make themselves feel better. We know for adolescents that um, it's critical in their developmental phase to be out in the world with their friends. So this has really interrupted their development. And I think that social piece is really key. I think lack of access to their usual activities and sports that they would enjoy and they would gain confidence from and, and increase self-esteem, those things get taken away. Couturier says some red flags to look for in the child's social isolation, talking about body image, and an extreme change in dietary patterns. She says to call your family doctor if you believe there is a problem.